Now, you might think it's a lonely job out here fitting horses with footwear, but David doesn't work alone. He's got a knowledgeable and talented assistant with a cold nose and a wagging tail. Take a hold. Take it to Barbara. Take it to Barbara all the way. Meet Skid Boot, the most amazing dog you'll ever see. David Hartwig discovered almost by accident that his wife's dog Skid Boot was something special. Appreciate that. Wait a minute. Hello? You don't talk Skid Boot. It's for you. No, 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 no. Whisper. Whisper. Talk to him. Yeah. Skid Boot and David's relationship almost didn't happen. Neighbors had complained about the dog's mischief, and Skid Boot was about to be given away when David made a connection that led to a partnership that changed both of their lives. And in about five minutes on my living room floor, I could throw a toy out across the floor, tell him to wait, he wouldn't get it. Tell him to go get it, and on the way there, say, whoa, and he just stopped dead still in five minutes. So I couldn't wait for Barbara to get home. And I said, you ain't gonna believe this, and I showed it to her. And she said, see, he is a good dog. We ought to keep him, you know. Wave your left hand. Wave your right hand. Wave your left hand. Wave your right hand. Wave your left hand. Now turn around. Take a hold. Wait. Turn the other way. Ease up on it. Now touch it. Okay, back away. As back Skid up. Boot learned more and more ways to amaze, David and his new sidekick started performing at rodeos, and the world started to take note. In the national competition Pet Star, the little dog from Quinlan, Texas, won the grand prize. And the gold medal and $25,000 goes to Skid Boot! From Letterman and Leno to a visit with Oprah, Skid Boot's grown accustomed to the bright lights and limousines. You know, he changed my life. He opened doors for me. I've met people that I would have never met before in my life. Oh, we were on Oprah, you know. I mean, how are you going to meet Oprah, somebody like me? And, and Skid Boot and me had a ball. Okay, now I'm going to count to three. Skid Boot, when I say three, I want you to get that toy. But don't you get that toy until I say three. And you better listen careful, because I'm going to do the counting. One, two, six. <laughs> Seven. Okay, I'll be nice. Fourteen. Twenty-nine. Ninety-eight. Seventeen. Three. Back closer to home, Skid Boot and David are regulars at churches and schools. Skid Boot lives to perform, and David sees it as his duty to bring Skid Boot's joy to others. Tag my hand. 